would. And I still think a two-for-one at the end of the quarter is a good idea to score quickly and get another opportunity. Jurek's looking to score quickly, shooting it for Boxley. Tyler Chan peeled off as a defender, and it did not matter as Boxley elevates over the pack for the D.C. goal. What a goal. <laughs> Just when you thought Tyler Chan had a line to the disc, first the layout bid gives Cole Jurek a free backhand huck, and he's going to take that. If you're D.C. here, you've got time, but you don't want to take two, three minutes. Going long for Boxley, Randolph rating. Boxley, oh, in the air, skying and dishing. DC converts with Ort in the end zone. Christian Boxley, he has done it all tonight. What a play. So I mentioned how the Royale had some great pulls and then that one goes long out the back of the end zone. As Monroe goes deep, he has Boxley as the target, and Boxley, what a sky! Brings it down over Brandon Adibe. That was incredible, especially because they had two cutters in that same space. So that's a pretty crowded area to be. Another chance for Carolina in the red zone. And no timeouts. Cross field hammer, it's a hanger. Boxley! With the block. You know, some games you have a bunch of 30, 40 second points. Back to the sideline and rest. Recharge. Russell on the mark. Boxley, the big block in the goal line. Finds Knopf. Boxley with plenty of wheels. He's in the end zone. Around windmill snag from Thomas Edmonds. Edmonds hasn't been a, a Rowan analog but he's been good so far. Looking for Merrill, got him. Sometimes he just feels like a robot, just the insider around break, do it again. Sending this one for Boxley. McKelvey can't make the play. Boxley read it well, boxed out well. And puts the breeze back up by three with just over a minute to play in the third. Didn't get there though, long cross midfield. Here's Bloodworth, 25 yards away, and that disc was knocked down, and it will be a turnover, no whistle. Philly took Toronto to the brink a week ago, or took D.C. to the brink a week ago. Boxley catches that angled one, and Roy is open deep, but he goes underneath, it's Edmonds, and Boxley has the breeze score. In the science guys, right? It's amazing, and if you guys are, we're in Washington, D.C., Watching the breeze work it back and forth, back and forth. Now they're just about at midfield. He's going for the huck. Monroe. Okay, I will Looking say Boxley. again. Boxley. I will say again. Yes, Whoa. sir. Yeah, there it is. There it is. It's just hard to it's hard to beat New York on the huck, but there is a matchup. He was overmatched and uh, brought it down. Christian Boxley with a step. Jeremy Knopf, Andrew Roy, and McDonald are the three defenders back, and that one is floated. Oh, and the second attempt, is it up? They're saying yes, the Philadelphia sideline disagrees. This is Boxley gonna try and get it now. He does, inbounds, then back across to Ja, and Roger Chu is irate over there talking with the official. That's a tough one. I think what Roger's saying is that on that bid, Marx's hand touches the ground. Boxley to Roy. Back to Boxley being chased by Yuan. And Boxley with an air bounce backhand perfectly placed for Thomas Edmonds. Breeze within one. De Boston, 20 seconds à faire au match. McDonald, maintenant avec le avec le disque, on veut bien gérer cette fin de quatrième quart. On veut, on entend le qu'un des joueurs du côté du Breeze là, qui indique à ce. Oh, Nissen is wide open deep, and yet Roy and Boxley working together. Multiple slash cuts up the line, and now there's Nissen wide open, and he will land in the end zone. Flyers just totally forgot about Jock Nissen. Well, Jock, you mentioned how he was wide open on the fourth side. And it was after Double team here on Malks to start it. It was Hooley and Adibe. 
and instantly put downfield by Ort. And Boxley is the target, and Boxley makes an awkward catch, but an impressive one nonetheless. Euh, masculine. Et ensuite, il y a euh, Ben Ort, le numéro 9, qui évolue avec euh, les Pays-Bas. Euh, un des joueurs vedettes, d'ailleurs, des, des Pays-Bas. Le Breeze qui a effectué des changements. Alors, euh, la ligne offensive, c'est Boxley qui se démarque, malgré la pression défensive de Tremblay Jonca et qui alimente. DC is working out of what essentially looks like a horizontal stack here, either by purpose or just kind of that's where they happen to be right now. A lot of space to work with. Beautiful reset throw by Boxley to Ort, who will go back to the scuba. So nice, he's done it twice. It's into the end zone to Cole. Jurek, another goal for Jurek. De Carr, c'est Monk qui fait la passe. C'est commencé à se faire tard, là. Mais on a respecté les 7 secondes autorisées pour tenter la passe. C'est Boxley là, qui se sauve avec une belle passe franche dans la zone de point. Un point, comme on appelle dans, dans le textbook, dans le livre de comment inscrire. Throwing this time against Ryan Drost. Yeah, they're going to keep mixing up those defenses on row and show him different looks. Now off to Healy. And Healy for Boxley. Ooh, who's wow. able to keep it in bounds? It did looks he? like. Indeed, he did. He drug his foot. Fancy footwork there. Breeze will finish the season at Philly next Saturday night, and then the following Friday at home against Toronto. Boxley shows off the speed. He shows you the acceleration that he has. DC just waiting for opportunities, but Boston, they are a team that's been able to get some big Ds in this spot against the Breeze. Just killing some clock, and Monroe to the far corner to Boxley, a goal and an assist for Christian Boxley to get.